Hi lovely viewers, it's me again, your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. Just now, just now, yeah. <laughs> just now I was watching that, mm. and I was, eish, I was surprised that there was a, a third attempt on Donald Trump. Imagine. Oh yeah, they, they, they don't like him, man. Mm. Gonna, yeah, I don't think he's gonna win even. <laughs> yeah, it's it's a very difficult one. Eh? It's a very difficult one. Yeah, it's a difficult one. This one, the stakes are high on both sides. The stakes are high on both sides. Right, the women, the women. You don't, you don't mess with the women, man. You have to respect women. <laughs> well, um, I, I, I always say that you know, as a, as a, as a person, as an asylum seeker, you never know where you will be. Tomorrow, I might find myself in America, so I am uh, exactly. I am restrained, you know, from talking about uh, politics in other countries because you just never know uh, where you might be right. tomorrow. So uh, I, I, I am really, I've learned diplomacy. <laughs> Being out yes, here sir. has taught me a diplomacy, not to talk about internal issues of uh, other countries. Anyway, right. we are talking about Zambia. What, what issues do you want to, 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 to speak about? Well, uh, my, my own, I, always, uh, I always wonder, because I know... Uh, you support the uh, the PF and all that stuff. So I want you. I want. I just want to to hear what you think about the criminal cases. Like for example, uh, I don't know if it's true, but then we hear on the news that the president's son has left the country and all that stuff. Okay. I understand fighting uh, political opponents based off like you know political nonsense and all that stuff, but mm. then. The nuggets of uh, of uh, of uh, theft, you know, like stuff. Right now, we're reading about uh, Bowman Lusambo selling land and stuff like that. I don't know how true that is, but I just wanted to hear your take on that and uh, what you think. You as a human being, not political, but you as a human being, is that a good thing? Yeah. Uh, what message does it send us, uh, the citizens out there? Because uh, let's be truthful. Like when stuff is stolen, I mean, whatever it is, uh, corruption, it affects the little kids. On the ground. So you are the father. What do you think about this stuff? Like, let's put politics aside. Let's talk as human beings. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, uh, my brother, you know, to start with, uh, I like that yes. you say that uh, you, as a human being, you know, just me as Shilufatayali, you know, because it's true when yes. you, we enter into the realm of politics, you know, uh, it is about who you are supporting. You know, regardless of who, yes. uh, what the person has done, you know, you you want to find excuses and whatever. You want to be political. Uh, you want to be right. evasive. Uh, that is that is just politics, unfortunately, uh, and it is it is on both aisles. You know, those who support Akainde Ichirema, even if he has done something wrong, if it is politics, yeah. they will always try to find excuse for for him. Same with right. uh, with the PF, but when we speak as human beings, I mean, firstly, I'm one person that abhors uh, corruption, and I yes. I have endeavoured to fight corruption, you know, from a long time, and it is my resolve that uh, in my leadership I try to fight corruption because, like you have said, it affects the innocent people. The money that is stolen is, is is not money for the rich. It's usually money for the no. poor people. That is the money that is stolen. So, whichever which whichever um, on either side, I don't support corruption. I mean, either on the opposition. This is why some people used to say, "Ah, but why are you fighting Haka in the Haka in the is in opposition, you know? Because I mean, for me, right. if it is corruption, it is corruption. It doesn't matter who is involved." either in opposition or in the ruling, it is corruption. Now, the right. cases that are happening in the country, the many cases that are happening in the country that are currently going on, even in our courts, um, some of them, surely, they are cases that 
uh, should be in court. And some of these people really, they need to account for whatever they did when they were in power. I totally support that. Um, and right. I'm speaking as a human being. And then on the yes, other sir. hand, there is also a, a large, a, a, a significant um, part of it. Portion of political. Yes, where people are using corruption, you know, to uh, victimize, uh, persecute, and intimidate others. That is also there. And I want to say that no, this, this, this is not just happening in UPND. It also used to happen in PF. It has also been happening in, um, you know, in MMD. It is also happening in, your, in America there. So it happens almost everywhere. Okay? It is normal. And this is what is happening also in Zambia. So my message to the Zambian people, first of all, is out of what your question is. Number one is that corruption is bad. You know, and it doesn't matter who is involved, and we should strive to fight against corruption. And then, secondly, right. on the cases that are currently going on in Zambia, I think we should try to be objective before we criticize just because it is Bowman, just because it is right. in, it is Garin Combo. Before we defend these people, let's look at what is being adduced as evidence. And then, thirdly, right. I mean, let us not be naive to take every case as a case of fighting against corruption because some of these cases are political. When you talk about the issues of, uh, of, of Bowman, I mean, frankly speaking, Bowman has got a, re a number of different cases, okay? Some of them involving to, you know, proceed of crime. And most of those cases, I don't, I don't buy in those cases. But then there are some cases really that you need to look at to say, hold on. I mean, there are victim, there are victims here. Because from my point of view, I look at cases in terms of victims. If there is a victim, if there is a victim or there are victims, I mean, what right do I have to defend a person when they are victims? No, because even the victims right. deserve justice, you know. So in there are some cases that really I say, mm -mm. here there are victims, there are people who need justice. And as such, I mean, such cases should be prosecuted. So um, that's that's all I can say. For example, there is this news. No, he got eight hundred and fifty thousand from somebody. You know, in pretext that he's selling a house. I will tell you that there are a number of such cases around Bowman. And these people, if indeed they gave him the money, I mean, they have a right to justice. You see. So yeah. that is that is the issue. And uh, on different people. You know, when you talk about the Malangi case, for example, the Malangi case, I was just talking about it. When I look at the evidence that has come out in court, honestly, I mean, it is only fair that uh, John Malangi uh, comes out to uh, explain about the resources. I'm not judging him yet. I want to hear, right. but I would want to hear where was all this money coming from, which, you know, he paid there, he paid there, whatever, whatever. Where was the money coming from? I would want to hear that from him before I can make a conclusion. But the, but when you look at a person like he, like Freddy Sonyamba, you clearly see to say this man doesn't need to be in, in, in court because all he did is to do his job, he performed his, job, his duties, and that's it. So that is my response, and I, I hope uh, you um, are, are making sense to you. That makes sense a lot. Um, Matt, sorry, I, I'm taking too much time. But my um, other question was going to be like, uh, you deal with a lot of lawyers in Zambia, right? Mm. Uh, wh what's your take with them? Like, these guys are, these guys are educated. Like, uh, you know, we, we trust them to be able to, uh, uh, to prosecute or maybe defend us fairly based off the laws and everything. But when you see all this stuff and everything, like, what, what's, what's, your, what's your experience with them? Uh, can we trust into our law system? Is it compromised? Like, are, are our lawyers are scared to do their job? Well, I mean, I'm not on the ground there, and I don't have a lawyer in Zambia. Yeah. Uh, but, you know, sometimes when I look at this stuff, and I'm, I always ask, like, where are our lawyers, you know? Okay, so now listen. From my point of view, lawyers yes, are in business. Lawyers are in business yes, just sir. like people who are selling shirts, okay? And when you go in a shop to buy a shirt, 
the owner of the business will not ask you to say, where have you gotten the money? Is it money from corruption or whatever? I mean, they are in business. So from, from my point of view, as a person who has had an interaction with a number of lawyers, I have no problem with lawyers. I think our lawyers in Zambia, they, they are okay. Okay, of course, a number of them, when you are, if you are, if, if, I, if you are asking me, for example, to say, I'm looking for a lawyer, you know, I would want to advise you to say, pick a lawyer that is serious, because some lawyers, you know, they are not serious. You find that, you know, you have a case, he just picks, a, he just goes to the office, picks a file in the morning, you know, and oh, the, the next he opens it, it's in court. Once he closes the file, the next day you come and open it, it's another day when you are in court but there is no some of them they don't prepare well and they let down a number of um, of, of clients equally on the on the dpp's office some of them some of these prosecutors they are also just like because they are also lawyers anyway they are also as bad as those commercial lawyers whereby they right. go to court you know they are prosecuting a matter but then they just open the files when they are in court. They don't prepare. So some of the cases which are supposed to, uh, you, you know, where we're supposed to secure a conviction, you find that, I mean, the case uh, is messed up. Like there are some cases, even some of these high profile cases, where I could tell you to say, here, uh, uh, they didn't do a good job. They didn't do a good job. So, but uh, all in all, I think our lawyers are okay. Where we have a problem, it is on the judiciary. Judici our judiciary is highly compromised. Compromised mostly because people are scared. I think President Akainde Ichilema has done so much to intimidate the judiciary, such that these days when they are in court, before they pronounce themselves, they are thinking of what will the state say? What will be my consequences? We have, we, we, we have seen judges being removed very easily. Even, you know, these three, three, three constitutional court judges, those are high profile right. judges, you know, from the, from the, from one of the, one of the highest institutions, because we have the Supreme Court and the constitutional court. I mean, to remove those judges, surely they must, it must take something, but it just took, you know, one simple cadre who could not even construct a sentence for himself. Right. I mean, to report this matter and the next day they were out. Clearly, whichever way you may look at it, those, law, those judges were removed on political lines. And that is why we have a problem. Then we have also the Chief Justice, who is seemingly not protecting uh, the judiciary. Because, you know, the Chief Justice is supposed to stand uh, with the judges, you know, to make sure that right. they are independent. In, in, their, in their work, because judges are supposed to be independent. For example, you cannot be questioning, you cannot be punishing a judge for a judgment that he made. It, even if it is wrong, you can't punish a judge for a judgment that they have delivered. You can't. You can't, because then you're right. compromising their, their, their independence, you know. And then the, yeah. that tenure of security, it must be there for real. You can't just get a cadre and give him a paper, goes to, um, to, to, to uh, JCC, and tomorrow a judge is out. And then look at the people who are at JCC. They are all friends of the judges, form, of the president, former lawyers, former colleagues, relatives. So it is a mess in terms of uh, judiciary. Yeah. All right. Well, thank you so much. I keep okay. listening in. Thank you, my brother. Thank you. Hello? Hello? What are you doing? I'm doing it. 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 I'm Eh, ah, 
Because we shall remove an Akavamo. Because who would it wait? They would have a PF, they would have a UPN, they would have a Tayan, watch out to say. M. Quite. Never let under the name of 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 Okay. Yes. Okay. Are, you, are, you, are you a truck driver or just um, ordinary vehicles? Truck driver. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Because it is natural. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Now, who was to a quarter of the room, but I will rush at NPF, Ninan, what may Sunday once. One time, yes, one time I was in Southern Province, it could be 2021. I remember learning about Dr. Kenneth Kaunda Basu. Mm -hmm. Now, in Southern Province, in Shalom, but it's not a point. So, for that time, because of a memorial morning, maybe I'm Michelle, Michelle Mutranda Mutsu, we will have a start declaring about Tekanga Bafua. National morning. So I want to, yes, I want to do a Nasat group that. But I know the Panama school to the one that you fully have a Panama Panama and Dosiati, Muchamori Kiriro, Vacateca Maris that declare national money. How should I know Scott? Vacateca Vesa. If you get under what I should have a pinch of your cheating in That was in Southern Province. Mm. At Vacateca Vesa. I'm going to tell you that I'm going to tell you that I'm going to tell you that and we used to chat with those people way back to Rwanda to Rwanda. I was not able to meet the chairs. No, I which part? But this time around, we were under the party. We were not able to meet the people in Rwanda. We were not able to meet the people in Rwanda. We were not able to meet the people in Rwanda. We were not able to meet the people in Rwanda. We were not able to meet the people in Rwanda. We were not able to meet the people in Rwanda. We were not able to meet the people in Rwanda. We were not able to meet the people so, but I was going on a total assassin of family of Muria Bomba, Konkan, Police, and Mipari Bakalan. Just my daughter. Yes. Hello? 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 Yes, yes, sir. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes. What I have been following for a long. Thank you. Um, the folks in the Puyama Kachi, yes, you are for Mao Sampa. Namusha Sampa, I create a problem with Kalamba Sana, whereby I'm a non partisan. I'm non partisan, but accordingly, if an artist has observed Mao Sampa, I create a problem with Kalamba Chalo. Okay. I remember last time. Um, you brought it to Kobati. Maos at Ampokuya Kumagaiza. That day, we even tried to call him Arishina phone. Mm. I was following you. Yes, yes, I remember that. So, <laughs> you remember? Mm. I'm your follower. So, mm. what happens is, I have become a problem with Kobati. I mentioned my for Kutkam because you can't trust him, Maos. We can't trust Maos. A poem in every party. Then, party no stabatal, honestly. They can know what he named Chipmashila Kalipa to have a patience. We know what we are doing. Mm -hmm. A lot of people, they are not saying, they are not talking. Mm -hmm. Why? Because of who? Mm -hmm. They are following people. Mm -hmm. Once what they are talking to, Bakman and Pashota Media, they will follow you. So, Ukwa Fair Party, we are safe to live quiet. A lot of people that have changed their mind. Mm -hmm. Moreover, they are going to try by all means. They have failed. Mm -hmm. They have failed. Takuli na ngwa kwa kesi ni shini shwa kwenye tena dalama kubantu oceani. Kama ma placing as well. But a normal person who got five common sense. Now money feeling too fifty rich tika. Where are we? Where are we are now? People that are queuing for mil mil. Mil mil alikuwa mo ne pua bantu baleta tena mirongo. A long time ago, it didn't to a toilet cooler, Maka Honda. But it woke up until zero five. Now, can you imagine in that time we created 2024? That is a bunomo. So I'm darling, the man of 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 the 
UPND is no longer. I, I can assure you. Because if you go, I mean, I'm to have mm. I voted for him. Mm. But in I mean, I'm going to have a ten. That is a lavish mm. But I can't vote for them. Why I mean, I'm going to This time, I'm going to pass. Not to collect the area, she'll have UPND. I'm going to have a quarter But they are quiet. Thank so you. let's just organize ourselves in our brains mm. to happen and believe in the state Because you guys, anyway, I can assure you, all what you want, I can fight to feel the moon saying. Now here in Zambia, we're not like that. Mm. A spirit is quite out. To feel the moon saying, you know, Papa, Shaban, to skate. But Zambians, we are not like that. No, there's a few more in what I work with. Judging it, there's a few more in it. And what we have to emphasize, whatever it is, what we have to emphasize is that. People must register to vote. I know they are um, trying by all means to find a way of rigging the next elections. But uh, no the first way. things first no is to make sure that uh, people register to vote. Please register to vote. Um, Thank you. Um, Zambia, Ninga Chinja, um, Zambia, Ninga Chinja, win. Mm. Honestly. Mm. No, thank mm. you, my Good brother. Good night, Mr. Tari. Thank you. Hello. Hello. Hello, good evening. Good evening, how are you, sir? Fine, fine, thanks. All right. Um, I also want to ask, like, uh, the previous call out codes. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, but for me, I want to ask, then I cut so that I can listen through Facebook. Okay. Okay, so the first question is, um, I want you to comment on the issues surrounding the eligibility of uh, ECL, not as a politician, but just as a human being who understands laws. Mm -hmm. You understand that? Mm -hmm. Yes. Then, yeah, then I also want you to comment on the cost of living, uh, what has caused the cost, of, the cost of living to go high, you know, the buying of Mirimi and everything, as well, not as a politician, but just a, a normal human being who understands these parameters. Mm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Then the other one I wanted to ask, I think you already answered it when it comes to these convictions which are going around. That one, I think you answered. Just just these two. Uh, so I'm going to cut and listen through WhatsApp. I mean, Facebook. Okay. So, All right, thank you. The first thing on eligibility. The issue of eligibility, I will go back a little bit to give a bit of a, a background. In the previous, because a lot of some of some of the people that make arguments on social media, some of them don't understand. You see, um, our constitution from 1964 up to today. We have been making amendments. We have been making amendments. We have been making amendments. And um, we, we had the constitution, I think, he, of, um, is it 1991 to, uh, to about 2016? Anyway, the con and then in 2015, we had another amendment. Okay? So we have versions, and if I'm wrong, I, I stand to be corrected. I think we have about three versions of amendments. So maybe let me just say three, three versions. Now, of these three versions, let me say like the second version. The second version, which is when Sata came into power, we were, we were in the second version. Okay? I stand to be corrected about that, but I'm just trying to say something so that... Uh, 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 you understand. So we have this. We had the second version. This second version, I think I'm actually right because the first one was 1964 to 1973 when we changed to one party state. After one party state, then we changed to a uh, Mount Partism, okay, which is in 1991. 1991 until this time when it was changed. So, okay, in the second version, that is when Sata came into power. And in that version of that constitution, in that version of that constitution, when we talk about the presidency, when we talk about the presidency, the constitution said, the constitution said that a person cannot be sworn in more than 
twice. That is what that the second version was saying. The second version, okay, or the second edition was saying that a person cannot be sworn in more than twice. He cannot be sworn in twice. That was like the second version, okay, the 1991 edition. Meaning, it doesn't matter how long you stay in power. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. You could, you could, you could uh, become president today, you are sworn in. Okay, you stay three months, you are out, and then for whatever reason, you come again and you are sworn in, you know, and you stay president for another three months, meaning six months. It doesn't matter, it means for you, it is done because you have been sworn in twice. Okay, that was the second vision. That was the second vision. It said you cannot be sworn in more than twice, you can only be sworn in twice. So this did not matter. This did not matter in terms of in terms of um, uh, in terms of how long you you stay in power. It doesn't matter. So takulifia kwa no takuishetemu as long as you have been sworn in twice, that's it. Okay, that is the vision in which uh, uh, what is this Sata came in. And when he was dying, he left that vision, that constitution, which said only twice, you cannot be sworn in three times, only twice. However, so Edgar Lung, when Edgar Lungu came in, when Sata died, he was sworn in eh, in 20, that was the, in 2015. He was sworn in, 2015 January, as I remember. After that, when he was sworn in, that was once. Then next, he was sworn in in 2016. Now, in 2016, he was sworn in, that was second. Meaning, according to that vision of that constitution, that was it. That was it. Okay? Because he was sworn in twice. Now, we are talking about he was sworn in the first time in 2015. The next time when he was being sworn in, in 2016, we had a new constitution. That is where many people have missed it. 2015, we had a new constitution. Immediately, Edgar Lungu came in, he signed a new constitution. So, the next time that he was being sworn in, he was sworn in in a new constitution. And what was this new constitution saying? This new constitution which we have now, it talks about the theme. It talks about the term. It says for a person to consider that he, he has finished a term, he must have saved for more than three years. If you save less than three years, it is considered it is not a term. So we are talking about Edgar Lungu. One time he was sworn in in an old constitution. The other time that was sworn in, it was in a new constitution. This is where there is a problem. This is where there is a problem. The first one is saying you are sworn in only twice, that's it. Okay? And you were sworn in, first time you were sworn in, it was in the, um, in the, in the old constitution. The next time you were sworn in, it was in the new constitution, which was saying for you to finish it, to, to consider a term, you must have finished it three years. So, there, this is where the problem came in. What are we going to do? Are we going to follow the old constitution or are we going to follow the new constitution? You see what I mean? This is where the problem arose. This is where you saw the Dan Pule and others going to court. They wanted the court to interpret this. What are we going to do with Edgar Lungu? The first the, in the, he was sworn in, the first time he was sworn, the constitution said only twice. The next time he was he, 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 whatever, it was uh, it was in the new constitution. What do we do? And the court made, made a ruling. The court made a ruling. And what did the court say? The court said, since Edgar Lungu is a transitional president. Meaning, he transitioned from the old to the new. We will allow him 
we will allow him to uh, 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 we will not consider uh, we will not consider the one that he, he finished for Vasata. We will not consider the time that he finished for Vasata. We will not consider that as a term. Instead, we will consider only the 2016, between 2016 to 2021. That is the one that we are going to consider. For the one that he finished for Vasata, we will not consider it as a term. We will not consider it as a term. But we will consider the one that he did between 2016 and 2021. So the court made a ruling. The court made a ruling. And this is where many people have, uh, have remained behind because a number of them, they said, no, he was sworn in twice. The constitution said to so, uh, uh, sworn in twice. That's it. Yes, the old constitution, the first one, when he was finishing the term of Vasata, that's what it said. But the second one, it's different. But nonetheless, whatever it is, what is important in Zambia, our constitution is made either by registration, meaning, meaning the, 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 the parliament, or by, uh, you know, uh, uh, what is this, rulings, the judgments that come. The judgment that comes, they, are, they, they form part of our constitution. In other ways, what we say, this is why you see that uh, judges, when they are making the ruling, they refer to precedents. They said, in such, such a case, this is what was ruled. In such, such a case, this is what they ruled. Because the law is dynamic. The law is dynamic. So there can be a situation which was not considered in the constitution, and it comes before a judge. And once a judge makes a judgment, it becomes part of the precedent. It becomes part of the law. One of the examples that I would give is the Public Order Act. The Public Order Act, you know, there is a precedence that has been set. You know, I don't remember, uh, I mean, in the case of whatever, whatever, whatever. But there is a precedence, and that precedence should be, it has become part of the law. And so, in this case, there is a precedence out of the judgment that was made by the judges, where they said the time that he... Edi Galungu finished for Vasata was not considered as a team. Instead, they considered 2016, 2021. And that is why he stood in 2021. And this is the this is the position of the judges. This is the position of the courts. So me not speaking as a politician, speaking as a citizen, even by John Sangwa, who is a lawyer, also acknowledged this. He said, look. I, but John Sango was part of the judge, the, 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 the lawyers that was saying, no, no, Edgar Lungu should not contest. But when they made the, the ruling, when they made the ruling, they made the, they passed the judgment, John Sango was saying, since they have passed the judgment, I mean, that's it. That's it. Whether I agree with it or not, the judgment has been passed. We have to respect it. So that is why Edgar Lungu stood in 2021. And that is why some of us are against these you know, machinations of bringing back this, this case in court because they made a ruling that Edgar Lungu uh, had only done one term, which is the 2015, the 2016 to 2021. That is my position as, as Chirufatayari, not as a politician, but as Chirufatayari. You spoke about the issue of the cost of living. What has caused the cost of living? What has caused the cost of living, I'll tell you, is that Number one, when, when Haka Indian was coming in, there was a global economic meltdown. Global economic meltdown. We had challenges. Prices were going up everywhere. In America, in Asia, everywhere. Prices were going up. Okay? Including fuel and everything. And a number of countries took measures to look after people, to sustain people, to cushion people. So, unfortunately, from President Haka in the HDM and his government, they did not come up with good policies. So, I am admitting here as a person that there have been challenges in terms of uh, commodity prices going up globally. But the onus has been now on the individual government to take 
policies that will help people. Mind you, a government is there to help people. A government is there not for, for, the, for the rich, for the strong. No, uh, government is there especially for the, for the poor people, for the weak. That's why we have governments. The government brings uh, equity between you know, the, the rich and the poor. And unfortunately, President Haka Inde Ichirema has not come up with policies that will help the Zambian people, the poor people. What are those, some, of the, some of those policies? For example, he has been removing subsidies you know, from fuel. He has been removing subsidies from agriculture. And this has caused the prices of, to, uh, the prices of commodities to go higher. And instead of, you know, getting money now from the rich to bring to the poor, he has been giving subsidies to, sub, to, to rich people. A good example is the mining industry. That, those are rich people, the people who own the mine, those are rich people. But that is where Haka Inde Ichinema, he has given a subsidy in form of, uh, in, in, in form of uh, tax, uh, tax holidays. So this is where we criticize Haka Inde Ichinema to say, Yes, much as we understand these problems, uh, which have been happening globally, but Haka Inde Ichirema has uh, messed up by implementing harsh policies which do not help the poor Zambians. That is my position. Let me take other calls. You can call in. You can call in. I think I've explained you uh, about that. And I'm trying by all means, you know, to respond to you objectively without um, whatever, whatever, whatever. Mm -hmm. Hello? Hello? Yes, my brother. We have a winner. We have a winner for some name. Ah, we have a winner. I'm not going to be able because, uh, okay, you are, you are talking about uh, cost, of, cost of living. We have a president who is a man industries, who is a man 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 who is for a man, mm. but even even many of the number of three thousand in Gawai, they are picking on go. Let's say three weeks in mm. Shiap. So me, I think the best way is put put that for reduce. Said the two day for that, but it about the Muzambi or put it for a thing for a five yeah? Because it doesn't make sense. You're waiting for a 3,000 coach. Yeah? Mm -hmm. And here is a permanent secretary working, waiting for a 100,000 plus check. Yeah? So now, by how the way, the by the way, by the way uh, you know, just, to, uh, just for us, for clarity, you know, for um, uh -huh. to being factual, uh, well, permanent secretaries uh -huh. don't get hundred, hundreds of thousands. They don't. They don't get I'm saying, of I said, I said 100,000 plus. No, they don't get 100,000 plus. They don't. But they, with, they, within the range, within the range, 100,000. No, no, no. The range is, the range is about 40,000 to 50,000. I'm a permanent now, secretary. Now, look at. They get about, you, you are they get about 38,000, 42,000, somewhere there. So it is just between. 40,000 for to be safe mm. it is just between 40,000 and 50,000 that's that's what permanent secretaries get yes and you mm. they get somewhere like 18 in my government in my government workers they get 18.1 they, they usually get paid together with the other civil servants they are civil servants so they just get paid yes as civil servants really uh, in terms of dates uh. i don't think there is a 
uh, anything to talk about. It is just like any other civil uh, servant. Mm. Uh, so, in a, in, in a correction, I have a president of the For low income workers, there's no way we're going to get 3,000 after 30 days. That doesn't make sense. So, but what do, you, what do you mean? Are you trying to say that uh, people should be getting every two weeks? They should be getting at least within the range three weeks better. <laughs> because if you say, no, value for 15, for 15, it is 30 days before another 15 comes. So, uh, what are you trying to say? So mule for me <laughs> eh, exactly. Okay. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> okay, my brother. <laughs> that is his view. Cost of living is just too high. So, three for a twice in a month. Three for a twice. Go for a 3,000. Your 3,000. We feel our for a month twice. Per 15, we for a. And I'm sure per 30, we for a. You know, because in the total rate, per 30 to 30. Yeah, Chilamu. Hello? Hello. Yes, good day, good evening. Good evening, Mr. Tayari. How are you? Fine, thanks. Okay. Uh, I was listening to the program and uh, I'm very happy with the way you explained on the term that they keep on saying, no, Ed Garungu is not a job. <laughs> so, uh, me, my concern here is for Zambians people, they should be, it's them who are supposed to insist, in fact, so that we can have any elections. Want me to tell you the truth, I always want any elections because we are really suffering. Mm -hmm. You've seen, right now we are in darkness, but them, they lied that when they come, they'll end the road shedding. Mm -hmm. But right now we are in darkness. So the truth is he has failed because he, but Edgar Lungu used to road shed us only five, six hours, but they used to discampaign him. Mm. So if you're a wise person, you put yourself in other people's shoes. Mm. In our, in Edgar Lungu's time, we used to complain when the it was at 150. When electricity, when we used to, they used to give us road shading six hours, we used to complain. Now, as here, we give them road shading six to six. Mm -hmm. In fact, they were supposed to resign without waiting for someone to tell them to resign. Because it's a clear picture to show that they have failed. So let them use their wisdom and leave those offices. Because those offices, it's, they are not helping us at all. Instead of helping the poor, again, the riches, they are the one getting more rich. Mm. The poor now, they are suffering. Mm. So me, I'm not happy with what is happening. Every time when corruption is being involved, mm -hmm. the people who suffer most are the poor. God bless you. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you very much. Basically, for her, she yes. wants an early election. She wants early election because uh, her kind of HDM has failed. And frankly speaking, I do accept, I do agree with her on the, the issues that she has raised because her kind of HDM promised a number of things which she has failed. And surely, when you fail, I mean, it's only reasonable when people call for you to uh, to resign. So that is her view. Thank you. Mm. Thank you very much. Uh, Yeah, that, that, that is a, a view. And you know, sometimes people are intimidated uh, to call for change of government. It is like it's a crime. It is not a crime. It is a democracy. It is not a crime to call for change of government. It is not a crime to call for Aka Inde to resign. It is not a crime. Eh? We want to make it. No, you are speaking against the president. You can't speak against the president. 
How? What are you talking about? Hello? Hello? Hello, Mr. Tayani. Yes, good evening. Good evening, sir. Mm. Um, I just uh, want a clarification on uh, mm. the memorial service of Vasata. Mm. Yeah, because uh, there's been a lot of confusion and I heard something else from your program the other day. Mm -hmm. So can you please clarify how mm. it was supposed to be handled? Because I heard something else from your program and mm. there's been a lot of clarification. There's been a lot of confusion. Okay. And um, again, okay, I, want to, I want to be very sober in responding to uh, this issue very sober very objective look uh according okay. to according to uh, there was a meeting which was held at one point you know uh at cabinet office where a government and the, i think the relatives of uh, those that had you know lost their 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 loved one the, the family of the presidents before there was this issue, I mean, when should we do the memorial and whatever, whatever, you know, there was that confusion. When should we do the memorial? When should government come in? Because some families were uh, expecting government to be doing the memorial of these, uh, uh, late, the late presidents every year. Every year there is a, a memorial. They wanted government to give out money, you know, this and that. So, they decided that, no, we need to look at this thing and structure it. So, there was a meeting that was held, and this meeting decided that government, we will be, we will be uh, celebrating or we'll be doing the memorial for the first anniversary. Okay, if a president dies, the first anniversary... The first anniversary government will be will be will be involved. The next anniversary that they will be involved is on the fifth year. After five years, they will be involved. Then the, the last one, which is the tenth anniversary, the tenth anniversary government will be involved. Meaning, so the first year, if a president dies, the first anniversary, the first memorial, the the, the government will be involved. Then the second one, that where government will be involved, it's after five years. Then, after ten years, the tenth one, the, the fifth, the first, fifth, and tenth, government will be involved. After that, Nishapwa, government will not be involved. This was decided. I don't know if it has been gazetted, but this is one of the, you know, policies that was decided. Okay? So, um, Vasata, Vasata's, uh, Vasata's, uh, Vasata's memorial was the 10th one, meaning government was supposed to be involved. Government was supposed to be involved. Okay? Government was supposed to be involved. According, and this was not done by Haka Inde Ichidemano. This was, this was done during the time of uh, Edgar Lungo. I remember that. I don't want to mention where the confusion came from. But it came from one of the family of um, one of the families of the former head of state who who had died, and the family were you know making noise that government should you know come in. So they said, no, no, come on, let's put order to this, and they decided like that. We will be part of it, the first anniversary, the fifth anniversary, and the tenth anniversary. So in terms of this memorial, Iyavasata, government was supposed to be involved. And this was not done by UPND. When they started arranging for this memorial, of course, the family must be consulted. The family must be consulted. And I'm giving you even what was happening a little bit behind. When they started organizing, the family, okay, initially, the people that they made, government made, they wanted it to be at the cathedral of the, the child Jesus at the Catholic Cathedral. That's where they wanted. With Archbishop Alec Banda celebrating. 
with Archbishop Alec Banda celebrating. Somewhere, somehow, I won't give the details there. I know the details, but I'll leave it there. But somewhere, somehow, when they were trying to do the program, government and the people from the church, somehow, they didn't agree on some detail. They didn't agree on some detail. And when they didn't agree on some detail, government then decided to take it to the cathedral or to the uh, to the uh, whatever Anglican cathedral. They decided to take it to Anglican cathedral because that is where the program which they had proposed was accepted. I hope you are following me, and I'm telling you exactly as it happened. There was confusion between government and the people on the other side particularly i think from the church there is some detail that they didn't agree with and that is how government said not to allow to allow anglican cathedral and the family of basata particularly the widow particularly you know the widow is very important the widow and the the first son michael Sat, uh, what is this mulenga sata they agreed with government that it can be held at the cathedral of um, you know the the Anglicans. However, the PF the PF members they were not comfortable. They were not comfortable to go to the to the cathedral of the Holy Cross. Why were they not comfortable? They were not comfortable because of the rivalry that is between them. There were issues of 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 security that came in, where some people thought no Edgar Lungu might not be safe there. No, there will be too much police, whatever, whatever. So, because of that rivalry, the PF decided to say, okay, for us, we will not go to Anglican Cathedral. We will go to a cathedral of uh, the Catholic. And that is how you saw the, the PF going to the Catholic Cathedral and the government and the Michael Chilfasata's the uh, uh, f relatives went to Anglican Cathedral. What was bad, and things would have just been okay, because really, the PF would have had their, their celebration, Uku government would have had their celebration. What was bad was the police, the police knew about this. Be early in the morning, 04, they surrounded the cathedral of the, of the Catholic. For what reason? Only God knows. I mean, why did the police go there? I think for me, the mess that was there was the presence of the police there. That was what was wrong. They should have just allowed the PF to go on with their with their with their with their program. Now when our government they would have also gone in, gone on with the, with the with the program. So but they made a mistake by sending the police there. That is one. Secondly, Ku uh, Memorial Park. The PF, now they had organized, Edgar Lungu had organized to say, okay, these people will go there on Friday. For us, we will go there on Saturday. But when they went there on Saturday, again, they were police officers. For what? Why were the police there? So unfortunately, I think from my point of view, government, they would have done better to just go on with their program than what they did to send the police. I think that was a big mistake. Basically, that is my take around all that. Yeah. Hello? Hello? Hey, Vatari. Yes, my brother. What's up, my Bueno, bueno, Good. Good. Uh, the problem really for the Vatari but confusion, but the government was in charge of that program. Not that the government was involved. It was in charge. It was their program. And everyone support, must support that. Wait, wait a minute. Not wait a minute. Bring confusion. Wait a minute, my brother. Where wait a minute. Wait a minute, my brother. For the sake of the listeners, for the sake of the listeners, I don't want my listeners, my followers, to get a wrong message i think when you say government was in charge i i don't think that is that might be the right way to use 
Yes, government was supposed to be involved, not in charge. Uh -uh. Because when you talk about, when you say in charge, it means nobody else can. Uh -uh. It is not like that. A memorial of a statesman, you can't say only this one is in charge. No. A memorial of a statesman can be celebrated by different people in different ways, according to the way they want. Government will have their program. But if you want, you could also have your program, just like the PF, they had their own program. And uh, I, it, th th there was nothing wrong. Even me, where I am here, I would have had a memorial. I would have called for mass, you know, for Wasata. So uh, there is nothing wrong there. So just to, for us to, uh, you know, to give a, a right message to the people, they were supposed to be involved, but not that they were in charge. Sata was a statesman, he was a president for everyone, and anyone can celebrate his anniversary. I agree, I, I agree with you. Mm. I agree with you, but I want to say the people that were running the program was not PF, neither PND, neither CF, neither Equity and the Economic Freedom. No. The people that were in charge and running that was the PS and they selected the people. <laughs> Equally came through. And when they made the program, it was very clear that the, the former vice president was to attend. The security was there put for him, and there was no one who was going to injure the, the president. If the government wants to go and the deal with the former head of state, they can do it even right now. They did that to Mr. Hika in the paper. They went to the house, they fished him out. Government did to fish him out. Went fine. So there was nothing there to say security concerns. No. When you want to run a program like that on a memorial, we should not allow people to bring confusion to run parallel programs when the government and the family have agreed that this is happening at this place. So I'm uh, not happy with the performance of the PF on that one, but the UPND, the government of UPND behaved in a way that was not right by not uh, trying to stop them. But I think they realized later that's how they allowed them to proceed. I yeah, agree. So, but mm, I agree with the you. running of two parallel programs, I would say I'm not happy with that. Yeah, I agree with you. I agree with with, with what you, with what you are saying. I really wish there was unity. Uh, my view, really, I wished that on such a day we could have seen unity. I really wished we could have had that unity. I really wished. Unfortunately, it didn't happen. And this is why, if you remember when I spoke about it, I said there are things which I don't agree with government, and there are things which I don't agree with with PF when I spoke about this. Uh, earlier, uh, because I wish there was unity, but there were things which were done, you know, wrong on both sides. But more importantly, more importantly, which really messed up everything, it is the presence of the police at a church. Surely, uh, the government, I don't know what the, uh, this government is doing, but they are, they are really messing up big time with the use of the police at every instance. Because that is giving a confirmation to the outside people that Zambia is actually a police state. Zambia is going into dictatorship. I tell you, I had a meeting here. I had a meeting after that. I had a meeting with some people who were asking. Because here where I am, a number of international organizations do call me and clarify certain things. And they, they, they spoke about that. So I, I, that was very wrong. They should have just left the PF, you know, and they should have gone ahead by government to do with the thing with the family and just ignored the PF. It was even wrong for the, the, who is this one, uh, Mulenga Sata, to even be mentioning them. They should have just ignored them and just gone with the, with the program. But now, look, we are discussing Waka Pokola. Why should we? Anyway, um, thank you, my brother. Thank you. No, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Enjoy your evening. Thank you. Sure. Mm. Hello?
Hello. Good evening. Good evening. How are you, sir? Fine, fine things. How are you, sir? I'm okay, sir. Just want to make a contribution. Mm. Yes, sir. On the issue of the memorial, I think the way I see it myself, there was not a big issue where uh, government can organize the gathering and some other people can organize another task. If anything, it was just about playing. There was nothing like politics where it was a rally or something else. It was just about playing. Uh, it's like uh, a memorial can be held even in Lusaka, Lola, everywhere. People have, have to play. But what was there was, the fear was, they never just wanted the room to be part of the program. That's why the government has to sure that all the people have to go to the program which was organized by them. Mm, mm. Oh, sorry, I lost that one. Sorry. Hello? Uh, hello, hello. Hello. Hello, yes. Um, can I contribute something? Please go ahead. Please go ahead. Yeah, my con contribution, I'm so angry. I don't know why HH is using the police. Mm -hmm. So much that they're, they're turning the country into a police state. Mm. Is, is, instead of Kadas, he's using the police now. Ma Ma'am, can you can you can you speak uh, you know closer uh, loudly so that people can hear you? Okay, I'm saying instead of the Kadas, he's mm. using the police as the Kadas. Mm -hmm. Now they are the new Kadas. Mm -hmm. Every small thing that happens is sending the police, tons of police. Mm. You know, that is agitating, you know, people. Mm -hmm. is, he, today I heard he was, uh, he was, I don't know where he was uh, officiating, and he was saying, um, Lusaka is lying to me. Mm -hmm. Nobody should be nobody should be able to lie to him. He should know what is what is happening. Mm -hmm. I think the truth has just dawned on him of what happened in Botswana. Mm -hmm. That's my contribution. Thank, thank you, thank you very much. Uh, thank you very much, Mam. I, I I I I agree with you. I mean, the use of the police mm. at every instance is. Uh, really painting a bad picture on our country yeah mm. hello 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 i'm in the third we know when i film quite i'm quite a boy but uh i didn't land the phone yeah uh we boy Ulika ume, mwisho na kwa wati Oshwa, ok, wantu tawala ndapo sana, but wali papusha kwa fiaka chalo kesu, pantu Ii wacha ya kwa tuwayoko, aa, ya li mpapusha kwa fena inewini Hey man, on that one I give you a pat on the back You know? Na isa kuna na ikara na mbo kuna na tuti Haa, ulika ume woi, hapo fena na yukuperu mchenshu Hey, but my concern, my real concern is this, my friend of course, uh, I'm, I'm not happy with the government of the day and everything. I'm not. Eh? Mm. My, my concern is, in mm. 2026, 2025, the other one, the other next elections, basa mm. pita foot. Well, you may not want to disclose your plans, how you're going to go about it, but do you think mm. of such eventualities sometimes? Yes. And then what you would do also? Thank you very much for that question, my brother. Um, yes, look, please. A, I'm, I'm, a, a lot of people might look at me like just a, a charlatan who just makes noise, you know, but I am mm. a, a well-calculated man. 
I am a very deliberate That's man, nice. meaning I calculate my steps. I know what I'm doing. Okay. I know what I'm doing. Every step, everything that I do, it is something that I think about and I see, okay, this is how I'm going to do it. So even when I left my country, even when I was leaving my country, I, was, I only had a few hours. I only had three hours before I could leave the country. Mm -hmm. But in that three hours, I made sure that I made plans. I made sure that I made plans. You don't hear many people being, being, uh, 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 f being affected by my, by my absence. Okay. I had a number mm -hmm. of cases. Mm -hmm. yeah. Why don't you see people being being uh, inconvenienced? Okay, because yeah. everything yeah. Yeah. there is no one who is suffering because you they are left. No, no one. Mm -hmm. I can yeah. tell you. I can tell you. No one. You don't have those issues that hey, cheater, cheater, cheater. No, nothing, because I planned, and of course my plans. You know, we say plan are fulfilled by God. You make plans, but God comes in. Indeed. Also, God comes in. So, uh, talking about uh, if Haka in the Ichirima, Vapita, Vaka in the Ichirima, I can assure you, and I want to assure the nation, including my, my, my adversaries, those of you who think that, yeah. no, when Haka in the Ichirima, Gapita, your sponsors, whatever, 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 first of all, my sponsors are not in Zambia. This is what you have to know. It is not people in Zambia that are sponsoring me. Yes, I have people that help me here and there, just like yourself, you know, Gamuakwa at the Vivian at all, to me one pin, and so on and so forth. But let's face it, the money that I need here is more than I'm a one pin and everything. I need more money. You yeah, are right. You okay? yeah, so are right. My sponsorship is very secure. Therefore, our, our press singer, therefore, my sponsorship is very much secure. Not only in this country, but even in other countries. I can decide to move tonight. I can decide to move. I am ready to move tonight. I'm ready to move and go to another country. And I'll still be able to, to live. Good. So, in Parwandi, therefore, I wish we Thirteen children, if you are that thirteen children, yes, in the edition, now I'm ten p and whatever, whatever. It's normal. It's normal. But really, I am okay. I am okay. I can do it. I'm not going to be twenty years. I will be able to survive myself. I'm not going twenty years. I will be able to survive. Why I make all this noise? So, so, so. Wait a minute. Let me finish, my brother. Why I make this noise? It is not for me. I'm going to be uh -uh. Why I make this noise? Mm -hmm. It is for the Zambians that are suffering. It is for the Zambians that are, that are suffering. That's why I make that noise. Trust me, I can stop talking. I can close up and everything. I will live in this country and I will do whatever I want to do. I will live comfortably. A person the focus on a motoka. I will live okay. I will live okay. <laughs> I'll leave okay. No, I'll no, no, my brother. Mm. My brother, I'm, I'm I'm very comforted to hear that kind of thing. Eh? And then he, let me also mention something else. Eh? Mm. I was very happy, but yeah, some of the so-called sponsors, I was very happy you told them off last time. Oh, that's why that I'm is very good. Yes. You have to come five pin. Yeah. In an ammo crawler, five pin, five pin taishi. Yeah. I have to. That's why I'm telling them off. That's why I'm telling them off. Mdala, Mdala, we are behind you. Personal, I'm behind you. And you know, change it. I change it. I'm gonna know I'm gonna be catching a musiring board. Eh? You know. Uh, <laughs> no, I, I give you. Now I'm gonna Now we can over over here. We're gonna be catching a musiring board. Why are you catching a musiring board? Ah, no, 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 no. Eh? Imagine. And for how long are you going to be in the ceiling board? 
Imagine. Imagine. Mundala de Sare Kupala. And that's the message also to so many other, these other useless people. Now we want to finish now. Yes. But now we can share. Now we can share. But why is our money here? Eh? Ah, no? Mundala de Sare Kupala na torte la sana. Chisuma, mune, chisuma. Eh? No, I mean, some of these people, it's, <laughs> it baffles my mind. You see that if it's not to be people, now we can have it. Now we can. Mpaka waisa waisa kuchaya. Ala? Mwafia. Hello? Eh, wafia zo na watari. Yes, my brother. Eh, ya! Eh, naki mpa. This boy, eh, kule afia mkuli ngwodi nomu. Oh. You did well, my brother. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, this people are not the most These people are bad. You know, Mr. Tale. These people, you know, you remember, even the time of fear, there was no police to go to school, so we tried for, for UPMG. I don't know why these people, they are doing like this now. Huh? <laughs> well, let me tell you, my brother, <laughs> let me tell you. If I, because today, mm. today is for, for a year, I'm not doing politics. Today, I'm just being yes, yes. sort of a dad. My friend, I'm a politics yes. here, cover. This is one thing. I'm a politics. How <laughs> can is doing politics? Even Ed Galung, when he was there, he was doing politics. Eh? Even Ed Galung, mm. when he was there, he was doing politics. Even when he chiruba and whatever, I'm a politics, say for Yaba. I'm a politics, say for Yaba. Yeah. I'm a politics. You should be ready hey, for all these kind of things. You should be ready for them. You should be ready. So how can they eat them? I mean, the guy is just fighting. He's, he's just securing himself. He's securing himself. And that's mm -hmm. why sometimes, sometimes, some of these people who complain. I mean, you. why are you complaining? You know some of these things. You see some of these things are happening. You even know. And you're just busy with mm. social media, Muledira, Muledira, Muledira. Come on, do something. Ow. Do something. Complain, uh, complain, it will help you. Why are you talking to me? Oh. Quish, where are you going to go? I can't fight you. Kuchamp. Mm. Eh. At no. Eh. Yeah, I... Ba, 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 you pay and dinner, but too much. Ba, you pay and dinner, but too much. Ba, you pay and dinner, but too much. What about you? You know, you pay and dinner, yes. eh, as, as just me. What about you? Why is UPND chasing you? Oh. Where are your supporters? Ah, oui. Where are your supporters? Mm -hmm. eh? Where you yes, need yes, to yes. play victim, victim, victim? Woman politics, it doesn't help mm -hmm. to play victim. It doesn't help to play mm -hmm. victim. Don't play victim in my politics. Yeah. yeah. Sana. That's, mm -hmm. That is the issue, Mwana. Eh, sana fia. Apa ni kufaiting nasi? Kubacha kwe ngo iyo ni wao cha kwe. Thank you, my brother. <laughs> I mean, it's useless to be playing victim. You say ni wao bole dila. You say ni wao bole dila. You say ni wao bole dila. Mama politics. It doesn't matter who is there. People in politics, they will always come up with imingalato. Imingalato is part of politics. Rigging is part of politics. Eh? Na mumona wangu chita haya chikampan from South Africa. Na muikarafi. Eh? Na muikarafi. Tamure randa no kulanda. You are not complaining about that company. That company which they have had to print ballot boxes. You know that that company is compromised. And na muikarafi. Ewa ma elections. Baka chiteri gero mga tampoku la elections. No, na wewa ma elections. Na wewa ma elections. Meanwhile, you are not doing anything. Eh? Where are your supporters? Why are you not doing something? Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Hello? Hello? Yes, my brother, you have come back. I, 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 I remember your, your line cut. Please, pick it up where you left from. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I was talking about the issue of um, 
players. Memorial players. Yes, memorial players can be held in more than but the issue which was there was they never just one day. You are on loud. I don't get it. Uh, your phone is on, on loud. Please avoid putting your phone on loudspeaker. Uh, please avoid to put putting your phone on loudspeaker. You are better off just calling normally and talking like you're just talking normally like that. Not on loud. It gives you whatever. And sometimes that's why maybe it even uh, cut. So, uh, this issue of playing victim, 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 it will not help. In politics, you don't play victim and get anywhere. You will not get anywhere. Hello? Hello? Yes, Mr. Tai. Yes, yes. Good evening. Good evening. Yes, Mr. Tai. Let me also continue. Just want to, uh, I'm just worried. Uh, mm. no? We are not talking about the uh, JJ. Uh, okay. Do you have any information about him? He's okay. JJ is okay. JJ is Thank okay. you. Mm, JJ, so much. that's all I can say. Pali JJ, I cannot say more, but he's okay. JJ is okay. Mm. Thank you so much. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Because I trust your words and I trust you. No, Thank you so much. No, JJ is okay. JJ is okay. Mm. Thank you so much. Yeah. Hello? Hello, but I had a good evening. Good evening. I'm quiet. Uh, and then the first of the that program here, mm. uh, I think I have a bit of a concern looking mm. on how this government has been running Chalo Chesu and also uh, the plans that he, Akainde and the UPND have mm. to 2026. Mm. Yes, this is what I have observed. Mm. From the time he came into power, he has been making plans of how he's going to win a my elections in 2026. Mm -hmm. And what he has planned is, he, I think, he, one, is to destroy all the big opposition political parties mm -hmm. by disturbing them or by dividing them, like he has done with the PF. Mm -hmm. And the next plan that I have seen that he wants to do is to get all the people, all the opposition uh, big people in opposition that are his threat arrested mm -hmm. and put them in cells not less than five years. Mm -hmm. And he has managed to do this because he, from the time he became into power, mm. he managed to grab the judiciary, mm -hmm. he managed to grab all the courts, mm. he managed to control the parliament, mm -hmm. and he's controlling all the organizations that can speak for the voiceless. Mm -hmm. And we have tolerated that. Mm. The Law Association of Zambia cannot save us. The Human Rights Commission cannot say anything. Mm. So uh, he has even now touched the Catholic that can speak for us. Mm. So now looking at his plan, the list that he has put down, he has consistently been following it. Mm. And if you have followed him so well, he has arrested almost all those MPs, strong MPs from PF, mm. and now you go for the top opposition political party leaders. Mm. I see all of them getting arrested. Mm. And at the end of the day, by the time we reach 2026, mm. paper for people to go and vote. Mm. Now, if this I've mentioned is going to take place, what advice would you give us, the Zambian people, mm. on solving such kind of a person? Because I see him doing it. Power! I see him doing it. He's going to arrest all the big, big people. Power belongs to the people. Power belongs uh -huh. to the people. Ichalo Vantu. When we lose our fear, mm -hmm. they lose their power. When we lose Chapa. our fear, they lose their power. That is my message to the people. That is number one. Okay, so number mm -hmm. one, real power. There is no politician who is bigger than the people. No politician, no, no political party which is bigger than the people. This is this you must know. There is no one politician who is bigger than the people. Once the people decide 
That's it. It doesn't matter how powerful you can have the guns, you can have the police. When people decide <coughs> you are gone. So, Haka in the Ichirima, with whatever you have said, I agree with you. One is making sure he has, he has destroyed PF because PF was a, the strongest uh, opposition, the former ruling party. So, he has made sure he has destabilized it. But mm -hmm. he has been whipped, 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 reduced in the corner, reduced in the corner, mm -hmm. only to be saved by yes. the grace of God. The only thing that is saving Edgar Lungu is the grace of God. It is only the grace of mm -hmm. God. And then, you know, you spoke about these other members surrounding Edgar Lungu. Most of these people are those who are surrounding Edgar Lungu. A number of them have been, yes. they have been arrested. And they are in court. Some of mm -hmm. them are. They are in and court. they have been arrested. And they will yes. continue. The list is there. Yes, and they will continue mm -hmm. being arrested, and they will continue going to prison, okay, including the wife. Mm -hmm. Then, apart mm -hmm. from apart from that, then you have spoken about the institutions of government. Haka Inde Ichirema has yes. taken control of all the institutions of government. They are on his palms like this. Mm -hmm. There is nothing that you can talk about. The police. Mm -hmm. The uh, you yes. know, the, the, the judiciary, everything. Judiciary. Yes. The parliament, the parliament everything is gone. The other thing that you have not mentioned, which Haka Inde Ichirima is going to do, is to change the constitution. Haka Inde Ichirima yes, is going, going to, to do change it. the constitution. He's going to do it. So all these yes. things, Haka Inde Ichirima is consolidating his power. He, be, he wants to become powerful. He wants to be like, he mm -hmm. wants to be like, like Kagame, who has been in power okay. for a long time. He wants to be like... But uh, Kagame is like a man. Uh, he wants he wa to be like Kagame. Why uh, can't he copy a man than copying nonsense from him? He wants to be like Museveni and so on. This, this is what Haka Inde Ichirima wants to do. Now, I, unfortunately, people are suffering. A lot of people are suffering. And so, the only way Haka Inde Ichirima can be stopped is by the people. He will not be stopped by PF. He will not be stopped by Edgar Lungu. He will not be stopped by, mm -hmm. by the law. No, he's not going to be stopped by the law. It is only the people that are going to stop Haka in the Ichirema. We need, it is you people who need to stop Haka in the Ichirema. And I know, Very I know true. it is just a matter of time. People might think that Zambians don't react. Zambians are passive. Zambians are not passive. Very soon. We are so docile. Very soon. Don't, no, no, no. Trust me, Zambians are not dosa. Zambians are not passive. No, 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 no. Zambians are not dosa. You know why I'm saying this, Bachirufia? Because this man has been testing the water and we are quiet. He exactly. has been testing every corner. Exactly. And we are very quiet. Exactly. Nothing is being done. Don't worry. Hmm. Zambians are like he, a young girl. Ngorefo mukashano muaiche. Usha pitamo. Mufi antua nikane. You know? You know? Yeah. They take their time. They will take mm. their time. Uh, not have a chip. Have a chip. I don't know. But they take their okay. time. They take their time. California. Sana sana. Utuwa utuwa chetu utuwa chivemba. Utuka utuka shana utuwa chivemba. California. Kwa chita California. Ngawa ya wakaso shi wa shani. Ai wafuse kifumapa. Iwa kutuwa fwaya ine. But mm. kare seka seka. But kare seka seka. Mm. Ngawa mwona kwa mm. ati, you, you can even be discouraged. But if you continue, mm. if you continue, how one day wuka puma? It's the same with the mm. Mazambians. If you continue, yes. you continue tempering with them, tempering with them, mm. one day it will erupt. Ine. Yeah, mm -hmm. because yeah, because it, it's so painful, but I had it. sorry to cut you short. It's so painful when the people that you believe and trust in to come and serve you are being persecuted and arrested for not even actually committed any serious crimes, but it's going to persecute, like he said. And then the other thing is, I wanna be like a KPF is coming up well, but you should not forget that he is also being targeted. But as people say they are being targeted, they mustn't see that they are safe. They are not safe at all. And we need, to, we need to wake up honestly, Monday. Yeah, listen. We need to wake up because... Listen, this, listen, yeah. listen, listen. We need to wake up. But let me tell you, 
Politicians will not save Zambia. Politicians. No. Politicians. will not save Zambia. Politicians. No. Banani, banani. All these names that you are mentioning, they will not save Zambia. Because some of these people, they are actually cowards themselves. They are cowards. They are cowards. One of the biggest problems that we are having among these leaders, they are cowards. Number one, some of them are cowards. Number two, Niba mundia mundia. Badia kun badia kuvidi. You know? Ngabalanda balanda. Baba Pelafika no no. They they Bashima. Bashima. A lot of them. A lot of them. There are very few people who are like me. I mean, me, I can speak for yes, myself. Yes, you have been so consistent in standing on the truth. In a good area, but still mm. more. My room upon. My room upon. I'm from Guido Kuba. In a good one, this I'm on there, but my room, cook, change, shaman. I'm on. But there are very few. Yeah, so, no. <laughs> so, mm. the only, the only, the, the, the solution is in you, the Zambian people. Mm. And don't worry. Mm they will rise it is just a matter of time zambian people mm -hmm. will stop haka in the ichirema haka in the ichirema is going mm -hmm. is only going to be stopped by the zambian people and they will stop him mm -hmm. and when they stop haka in the ichirema they will decide who they will put there it may not be even mm -hmm. edgar Lungu, to be honest no it, it may, may not, not even yeah. be edgar Lungu. it may not even be any of these leaders that you talk about it may just be somebody mm -hmm. else Zambians will decide mm. who they will put there. So Vaaka in the might be mm. very busy, you know, following Edgar Lungu, Shani, 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 Shani. Zambian people, when and they all decide, of you, but yes, yeah. when they will decide, mm. they will come and bring up a person that Aka in the will be shocked. So don't worry, my brother, mm -hmm. we are getting there. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. Hello. <coughs> Uh -huh. Hello. conversation yanu yamveka bwino now you guys are choka hapo. Are very wise and intelligent. Mm. Uh, point ya uh, previously before him. Mm. Ya mwezo kama na wacha mawafunza nanga our leaders are military now. Wow, that HH are playing a politics. I wish to intimidate me to do it once. Oh, PF, they were violent. Mufuna wa buwelele, abweze futi violence. But every, ashens are violence, the other way around. Kuku, ashens are makata wake, the other way around. Nanga wewe, my youth, wow, waliku uti. Point ya ene mwakamba, eh. Mwakamba point ya kuluma nini. Nanga wewe, because, nanga nani? PF, mwakamba PF, it's a big, it's a big organization. PF, nge, chipani chiriko chikuru, kuzambi ya chalamba tu. Mamunuza wanti wansa PF, wati yanga kwa hile wafi yanga wansa, kwa hile wafi yanga wansa, kwa hile wafi yanga wafi yanga wafi yanga wafi yanga wafi Bali ndui, chitotela, hey, mwaka mbaku hino, chitotela, wanamu mangia, chitotela, mvera, chitotela, is very powerful kwa mene anachokela, wanamu mendo mangia kwao kwa mene kuji, <laughs> kwao, <laughs> na wanti wake waliko, <laughs> so, eh, so, mwaka mbaku hino, langa nani, tiyanti shita soka tayari, mwona ki, Vamena kama previous caller uyu, vamena kama previous caller tima Zambia ni tiliko dosa wa tayari. I agree with him. Why, mm. why I'm saying so? Warona jitotela, mm. warona jitotela, wana wama ngira kwa wako yekuja. Mm. Wanikso nchirangu, wana wama ngira kwa wako yekuja. <laughs> Bono ni usambu, wana mpo, wana mpo korona city kukabushi. Majo malanjo, wana mpo korona city kuti, kukitwe. Wama nangu MPZ, wama sana manangu MPZ. Wana buo poki wama, wana buo poki wama city, muwai murungu, wama kambi ya chati mpambu za murungu, yes na seneza. Maje wana tuwa mene wama wavote, wama mene wavante, wana kuti. Mm. I was not expecting every time when there's a chat about 20 hours, it's your time. Now, I was asked, I'm going to go to the chat. 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 There's no use. Let's just manage to concentrate. I'm going to go to the chat. I'm going to go Masaka shita buwa njimaji, masaka sakira mtu, wafunika kwa kambila munga hile. Nane nina familia na wafunika kulanga na po munga hile. So na hebe, ni time ya wafunika wanyamu, kwa wasangare wa bona, wa zima. Eh, wate kukua, kwa PF, wengu kusukizu, wata wafunika 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 wafunika. Ah, this is no price. Twenty member, alama youth, wa memba zi wakili 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 wak
just go quiet. You know, Chima Kuawa, just go quiet. So I can't walk on Zira Kukamba. Zuko Mogambi, you know, uh, you know, one, I met one woman one time when I was in, when I was in Singapore. I met one Australian woman, an old woman. And, uh, you know, when she knew about my situation and she told me, you, you need to be patient. You need to be patient with people. Sometimes it takes a lot of time. Sometimes it takes years. It can even take 20 years. You need to be patient. For me, I am patient. I am patient. I'm not in a hurry. And I'll keep talking. I know when I talk, you know, there are few people that listen. Uh, I know my talk doesn't just end, uh, you know, with just me making noise here. No, I know that uh, people do uh, listen. And some of them, they they do the right thing. Hello. Hello. Good evening. Hello. Mulishani Matayali. Wina wina Fashani. Hello. Hello. That that familiar voice. Hello. We can hear you. We can hear you. Hello, Mulisha and Matayali. We know, we know, we can hear you. Please go ahead. Yes. Um. Thank you for everything that you are doing. Nacha for Kulanda Pari Ifirech Tika, the opposition. Nara Pera, for example. Like in the Nariu Papa Nari Kwataba Rumi, Mwanshiva. So, Mufte TSF, yeah? Ampo Kiaba Rumi Ninchikara. You know? So, Yes. <laughs> so I'm just challenging my opposition. Mm. What what is going on? Okay, now to we are just going to say how it is. Mubola Valandachi, home ground advantage. Tell you. Ngaulete am home ground you now what advantage. But Muzambia. Ah, I'm a politics here, Chitika. Mm. What is going on? You know, come a home ground here. No, go bare mingi, bare mingi. Mm. Ten zero. Come mm. a home ground. Honestly. Kawambua, kawambua, shua. Ah, we. Shua, pula kawambua. Ah, we. Eh? Now, ah, we. If we you have know, a UPND, you know, we have a UPND hey. uh, a chairperson. Honestly. <laughs> Um, every time bedroom. One time I have bedroom. I didn't even have a sitting room. You were in the bedroom. No more be one. Hey, at smart Excuse politics. my French. At the smart police. Hey. Ah, we, ah, we, ah, we. People, let's be serious. Let us be serious. Honestly, if a number is getting out of hand. Message and is like it. Protect your parties. Protect your party. So this is my message. Now I think we have talked enough, but uh, the sad part is just seeing how Avantu are going to home ground, the bedroom, Ukulaba send them a seats, Navetala. Even when they were in opposition, when they were in opposition, yes. you yeah. were in opposition. Who could go and you know campaign yeah. in southern province? Ah, we to be serious. Taka ino oleva tribe. Kashi lefo kumpa to oleva tribe. To oleva ndaki ama tax. Nangoni bola. There is a home ground advantage. Mm. So my question is to the opposition, what is going on? Why are you sleeping? 
Otherwise, to face a record, if you my political parties, you'll say two years side. Because that's why there's no round advantage. You people, you are just giving it away. On a silver platter, you are giving. That is my message. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. I agree. And look, we keep saying, no, things are bad. Whatever, whatever. But you are not putting up a competitive fight. Mm. Hello? 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 Hello, Mr. Tayagi. Good evening. Good evening. In a corner of Tayagi, as much as me, my mistake is a complaint. Eh, when as much as you, we all want numbers, but when you go to your page, I know you are a democratic person, mm. but the insult on your page, they are too much. So my request is some pages, some some people there, they are aiming just to insult. No, but I'm disrespecting it. So in a moment, my humble appeal, if you can please delete nothing, block those people, I will really appreciate you one day, because the insult is too much.
aba kwa gasonde mwenda aba shani bonze mukabafie muibumba limo i don't think so about tiba imano kuya mukuma ba I don't think so nga kutiba ima baya mkuma bandi. Ha, wana kala teti. Teti. <laughs> Because ni nishida mufula. Mm. Mwa mufa sana. Mm. Number two, ni kuma by election yu kubale randa. Chimochi neto ndefo kuranda selfishness. Mm. Yabao position yu kutuwa kwa tamu zambia. Mm. Mm. Echi lelenga. Mm. Mwane ni? Yes. Hello? Na bwera ba tayari. M kwa M kwa E. Ya chipotuka. Eh, mwa shiraba ti. Kulibe. Eh, lande. SPRI, SPRI minikanga candidate. Mm. Aba bonsenga ba mwena toke tatkwete amaka. Na muri ma PF bene ngaba chitirira di behind yes. Pako ba ti beta ile seat ya ko opposition. Dani ba ruling ba senda. Mamona? Sana fie. Ai Zani waluni ni wasenda. Apo, echi echa kulala ngiri latino mba upu ikatana mpaka 2026 kwa la moneka. No mba, ngatapari upu ikatana ichi mfurunganya oke mpie kwe mochini. Mwche na mbotna zi. Naba kwa te ichi mfurunganya? The answer is no. Ama bota zepo bari haba pie fu. Abe ngaya wafaba esu pino kui na ba sende chipuna. Nomba, kuli selfish ne si kada mba sana kuli ba opposition. Nga tabeka tene pali ino ine ishita. Ni ishi tawachitari bareti zambia. Mubwele leko MMD, MMD ero ya lefu nya po yonip. Avantu wonse ba chitari rari bia indi MMD. Yon sama political parties wali di bia indi MMD. Mpaka ya wina. Edo kaya idina vena haba kala mbaba li kumulu kubonza haba li tungula ma politiko pati. Babe keyafu. Bushe, bayu piendeba kula uma fia bantu. Pantu monsomu, bale uma bantu. Edo nukufurata bafura. Chinshi haba nono venga michi mfisha. Echi pisho venga la ipusi ya bonze. Bushe bayu piendi kutiba mkuma bantu. Chinshi haba nono haba nono. Eh, venga la michi mfisha. Ero chimbeto ndefo kulande Shisha mfumo na shota chile tuwa papa tayari Ale icho chintu icho Isha mfumo Shifuile shata mpo kulanda Nochi atiba shpere ndala masharia Shala baba ntu shiteka Nefo bale chula Awe That's why Infumo shpose kwa mano That's why Apo mulela ndapo I think Tufile tuwa kosele sha Ba mpezeni and we need to appreciate him for the way he spoke out last time. We hope that other uh -huh. traditional leaders can also, you know, be speaking, uh, we also pray that. Uwafia, you know, haka inde ichi le mali chenjira. Ame ishingi infumu. Bala shupela, bali wabika kwa ti mpai tu salari. Infumu shirafola from government. But bali fwa ka extra ngwe, eko baba pela. Fidia, bamo bamo, bala bapa kaka extra, kaka extra. Eno bamo bamo, bali bengi shaba na machito, baburua bwa machito. So bala filo kutashani, ukwe wa tibale ilanda. Ukwe wa tibale ilanda. Echo ba, baika lida tondolo. Na mumona, this time is going round from one traditional ceremony to the other. He's thinking, he's campaigning using that. But I know, he will not manage, he will not manage. Hoping from one place. How could you manage that? I had you, you moon too. He is the most coward person to talk about you, President. Number one, you, President, from the first time you were in the Mwenso. 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 No mba, pope nepo no mba ba opposition venga chita dominati. Ba mwona ati, ok, ifi ale ya mori inshila. Tuwala musenda mori inshila na ifwe. 
No. Not step ya mari report yo daba chita report outside the country you go daba ta na they never were chita ko report daba they ask because ba nankwe. Eh no thank you very much thank you. Mamona. <laughs> thank you. Hello. <laughs> Hello watari. Yes yes sir. How are you sir? I'm okay thank you. Uh, it's good. I want to pick on on something very different. Mm. This is a uh, regarding opposition politics eh? mm. and the service that never Mumba has done to the country. Mm. <laughs> now, when he took over MMD, mm. he had about 55, I think 54, 55 MPs and uh, numerous uh, councillors. Mm. Today, MMD does not have a single uh, member of parliament does not have not a council, mm. not even a council. Mm. So why is he still clinging on to MMD when he has failed lamentably to take MMD forward? Mm. Secondly, MMD is supposed to be, I'm talking about MMD or opposition politics, mm. it's supposed to be a, a party as an alternative government in waiting. Mm. So he has gone into alliance with the UPND to support the programs. He's forgoing his role as an alternative government. So why is he still in opposition or holding on to MMD? You understand? Mm. Yeah, so that's, that's uh, the other the, thing. Thing I was trying to drive at. Nervous Mumba needs to leave MMD to people who can form the alternative government or people who have got the interest of the MMD or opposition politics. Yeah, yeah. Now about the UPND, the UPND, UPND as a, as a ruling government, as a ruling party, is doing also a disservice to the country mm. by and annihilating all, all organs of uh, governance, institutions of governance, the, par the parliament, uh, the judiciary, is that th they are doing a great service and they should not be allowed to go beyond 2026. And as Zambians, whether abroad and wherever, we need to come together and get an UPND out of this, out of governance. Thank you, my brother. That's my contribution. Yeah. Thank you. Good day, thanks. Hello? 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 Yes, sir. Good evening, Mr. Daddy. Good evening. Uh, thank you so much. Uh, this is uh, Abro's Okay. Yeah. So, so I I also want to add uh, to the problem. Uh, I think uh, what we are seeing today, uh, with regard to the opposition, like you said, uh, I thought that being being one party. Your line is not very clear. I don't know what's happening there. I don't know if you, you are, are you putting it on loud or, or you're using headsets? Uh, are you getting me clearly now? Better, I hope so. Let's try. Yeah. So uh, what I'm trying to put across is the UPND being a single party. I, I thought they would never be this strong as to defeat the, 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 the opposition if they were united. Mm. But uh, unfortunately, it seems that we are so disorganized as, as, a, as the opposition. Mm. You see, uh, the, the UPND have uh, tried to infiltrate all the institutions of the government. Mm. Talk of the judiciary, the, 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 the legislature, everything. They have infiltrated them. Mm. You know, I was witnessing what was happening at UNSA, where they manipulated all the system for electing, <laughs> you know, the UNSA president and Imagine. everything. System. 
just manipulating everything. Mm. Can't the people, honestly, the people of Zambia, see that this government is trying to just be a perpetual government that wants to mistreat the people? Because what we are seeing is totally opposite to what we were promised as the youth of Zambia and indeed every other Zambian. We were promised something better as opposed to what we are, we are enduring today. I think it's, it's one thing that you have said. I want to agree with you that it's the people that need to remove this government and not the opposition that we are depending on. The people need to rise up. It is high time that we saw that this government does not mean well for the Zambians and has to be removed without any hesitation whatsoever. Otherwise, if we let them go on and on, we are going to suffer and uh, everyone of us will not have anything to do about it if we just allow it to continue with this trajectory. I think I have meant. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. And uh, indeed, indeed. Um, yeah, so a number of issues really have, um, have, have, have come out, um, out of um, these, um, the, 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 the phone calls that have been coming in. And um, I think uh, I'll leave it uh, here. I will not go into summarizing. I just want to say thank you very much uh, for participating. Like uh, I've been saying, the program comes now on Sunday, uh, Wednesday, and Friday. So my next program will be on Wednesday. That is when I'll have my next program at uh, 20 hours. Thank you very much. May God bless you and may God bless Zambia. Good night.